on a boat Who easily can open up and let somebody close No, I'm not one of those Who is the center of attention I'm not one of those No Some people might say I am afraid But I just do things my own way I don't know why Cause I don't like people pleasing And so Good morning my lovelies, welcome back to my channel and welcome to a very highly requested video I must say. I was asking you guys on my Instagram what you want to see and I put three, I put like a poll up and I put three videos up and I put H&M new in and like vlog, B&M new in and vlog and Primark, B&M one by a little bit but then it was really close with Primark so I think I'm gonna do a Primark soon as well and I've literally just pulled up outside B&M it was a really nice like drive you know sometimes you're driving and you're like oh like it was just it's such a nice day today really good vibes I'm just I'm feeling good and I'm so excited to see what's new in get some organization -y bits so let's go to B&M I'll show you guys what's new in and then if I pick up a lot of things I'll probably do a haul in my next video and then if I don't pick up a lot I'll probably show you guys in this video and then I also thought it'd be nice just to vlog over the next few days because I've got some really lovely things like I'm going to an event tomorrow I thought I could take you guys along and I just wanted this to be a lovely good vibes cozy vlog and I hope you guys are excited so grab your cuppers let's see what's new in B&M and I'm excited so let's go Running from all things at once Without thinking twice And I knew it would catch up And that we would be the ones Left behind mm. The stories I've been told They never seem to lead my mind mm. And this road that I am on Gotta stay here for some time Time has gone and I grew up I somehow made it through without Sight. Mm -hmm. And I still wonder where you are And if you found a way out From the dark mm -hmm. The stories I've been told They never seem to leave my mind mm -hmm. And this road that I am on I gotta stay here for some time Build 
successful shopping trip to the point where there is 1 million percent going to be a dedicated B&M haul in my next video because oh my god I haven't seen it that good in the longest time <sighs> oh sorry I'm listening to Harry Styles um yeah genuinely I haven't seen it that good in a long time ah that was dangerous but I've got everything that I wanted and more and I just feel really happy and I'm not gonna lie you can't even see that look where i went into after in this little complex that i go to there's also a tk maxx there's actually a hobby craft and a next and stuff as well and a curry's but i mean i don't really need to go to curry's i was gonna go home and then i thought to myself just have a little mooch in tk maxx i don't need to get anything it was more just to shop because i always shop for like videos and hauls and stuff like that and i picked up a couple of things so i'll show you this stuff that i got from tk maxx when i get home because it is so cute and i'm so happy and i'm so excited so it's a really successful day. I feel really just, it was nice to kind of spend time with myself, bring you guys along, of course, um, and just have a lovely day shopping. It's actually just really therapeutic and it's a good way to get your steps in, even if you're window shopping. Great way to get your steps in. If you don't like going on the treadmill <laughs> or walking, go shopping because yeah, it really does help. Um, so I'm really excited. Although two people have knocked on our door since I've been gone. Did you bring them? Why did that song come into my head? Yeah, two people have knocked on our door, so I've got some parcels, but I think one of them they put a slip through. I hate that. So, yeah, it's fine. Anyway, I will talk to you guys as soon as I'm home and I'll show you guys the stuff I got from TK Maxx. I'm gonna leave the BM stuff in the boot and then say to Brady when he gets home, will you help me carry it? Because there's a lot. <laughs> So I'm now home. I've popped on my gym wear because me and Brady are going to go to the gym later on. We woke up this morning and we were like, you know what? We haven't got any plans this evening. Let's just go tonight when we've got more energy because we were just so tired. Um, so we're going to go to the gym tonight. So I have my gym wear on and I've just eaten some food because I was very hungry. Um, but I'd done an order literally yesterday from one of my favourite brands, which is Katie Loxton. I literally have so many things from them because the quality of their items are amazing and you guys know me i love personalized things i think it just makes it that much more like personal and i love it so much so i got some stuff for me which i'll show you now so i got three things all in this color wave which i'm obsessed with now it's coming into more like spring summertime i wanted to go a little bit lighter so i picked up this gorgeous card holder again all of it is from katie loxton this is to fit in my smaller bags i have a big purse from katie loxton which Bradley got for me for christmas it's in black i love it but do you know when you have like little bags and you're like oh i just want a little card holder to put all my little bits and bobs in obviously cards you can't really put change in there i just love this one and it is really affordable next up i'm so excited about this i have this in black already and this is one of those things if you want to stay organized you need this in your life. It's this gorgeous notebook. So you pop this in the back of there. So you slide that in, you can put a pen here. There's loads of different compartments, like it opens up even like all the way through over here. You can put little bits, bits and bobs in there. Um, and I love it so much. And then it clicks like that. It is so cute and such a lovely thing to have, like pop in your handbag. Um, and then lastly, to match that, they've got this gorgeous laptop case and of course i had to get it um i really like how there's this bit here which i think is for your charger and stuff i think and then it's just open in there to put your laptop in so i really like this little set i'll pop a link to them in the description box down below because um they are so cute and then for my cousin they've sent a massive bag so she's gonna think it is something huge hello doggies he's saying hello to everybody did you miss everyone 
Oh, you put, you got your toy. You showed everyone your toy. Then it is my cousin's 21st birthday this weekend. So I wanted to get something really special that she's gonna use all the time. And again, it's personalized to her. So I got her this little clutch. Um, and it's a little bit like thicker, which is really nice. And it's got her initials on it. So I love it. I think she'll really like it. It's just really cute um, and something that again is very personal to her and then you can personalize these bags for free on katie luxton so i have and i've got her name on it madison and then it's in a really cute bag so these are just honestly the best gifts if you don't know what to get anyone for their birthdays or any present go to katie luxton because i genuinely couldn't recommend them enough like their items are such high quality and it's it really varies in price which is really good as well so i hope she loves this anyway i'm going to package this up i also picked up a card for her as well which says happy 21st birthday and um, which is so cute so she's gonna have this for her birthday and i'm so excited to give it to her although it's in a massive bag she's gonna be like is that it so it is now the next day um i've woken up this morning got ready i feel very glam but because it's an event i was like do i do my makeup don't i do my makeup so i've done like in between kind of makeup um but i have my black gym wear on today and then i've got adenola socks on my nike shoes um my leggings are from glow mode and then i've got this little top on underneath because it's nice and airy although i've just seen there's two marks here so i need to get a wipe and wipe that off um and then this jacket which is from tesco's and then i've got my adenola stuff in here which you would have just seen me pack um for the day because i think after the pilates me and rosie are going to go for coffee um, and then hopefully get some work done as well which is really nice and productive so i'm looking forward to it i'm just trying to think i think i'll quickly go downstairs now and show you guys the tk max stuff and then we can be on our way and get going it's about half an hour drive so it's quite nice to have a little relax in the car before <sighs> okay the bag broke like the handle because it's so heavy um also little sneak peek of some stuff that i got yesterday um let me do it on the dining table i've literally got to leave in five minutes so i hope this doesn't seem like i'm rushing it okay so i honestly feel like i got the cutest things in tk maxx so these are little spring paper baking like cups and they're called snack cups what a good idea um and i thought i could do like cute cupcakes and stuff in these and i love the print of them how spring and like summer is that i thought that is so cute and they were 3.99 you guys know me you know i love organization i feel like from like spring summer we're traveling a lot here and there like we've got little trips booked we're going away for my birthday we're going away this weekend to kent we obviously go on holiday and stuff so i thought whenever i see something like this I just need to get it. So this was only $16.99. How good is that? So DK and my little makeup case. Um, and it's like that inside all red and it's got a little zip compartment there. Really handy for when you're storing like your skincare and your makeup because you can actually like put the product upright, which is really good as well. Um, so I love that. And then to go with this, I mean, you guys know me. You know I love a bit of matching. So this is like same but different. This was twelve ninety nine, um, and I thought like this is either good for my skincare or anything like that. So they're both DKNY and they match, and I thought they're really cute. And I like the colour of this. It's like a dove grey. This is the same colour as my YSL bag. Love it. Picked up some tea towels. These were seven ninety nine, um, and you get a set of four. And these tea towels, like the quality of them, Bradley is going to thank me because. We always get the crappy tea towels because 
I love seasonal things, but I feel like the seasonal ones are always the tea towels that don't really dry, um, and they just let like fluff everywhere. So I got practical ones, and I really love the look of these. So I picked up them. I haven't even showed Bradley that. He's going to be very pleased about that. So this was one of the purchases that we actually have one of these. I did not need this, but I'm obsessed with like the aesthetic of it, and loads of stuff was coming to my mind for like content and things like that, and I love the colour of this marble and the gold, so this is actually like a, it's like a marble crusher, so you can crush like herbs and garlic and stuff like that for when you're cooking, um, and I love the look of this, so I mean, I think this will look really lovely in the kitchen, and I want to have this on display like all the time, so I thought that's really lovely. Of course, I had to get some candles, um, so this is chamomile buds, this smells so lovely, oh, it's a coconut wax blend, how lovely, but the packaging is so pretty, and I think... It was 10 99 yeah, and it honestly, ugh, two wicker, smells amazing and looks so lovely as well. So I'm very happy with my candle. I had to pick up another candle. I've just realised though, I reckon this had a lid, a gold lid. Do you reckon it's in here? It is. <laughs> it fell off. I was thinking, normally TK Maxx candles always have lids. Um, so this is such a lovely candle. Um, it is peony with rose. So it smells insane. Is it even in focus? There we go. It's like a ribbed candle and the colour of it is so cute. Um, and this was $7.99. So I got two candles because can you go to TK Maxx and not buy candles? I can't. And then the last thing I got was this scarf, so this was 12 99 it honestly feels like cashmere, and this is <laughs> something that I've been after for so long, like this colour scarf, and I found it and I was so happy, because do you know when like, the transitional kind of seasons, I always like to wear a scarf because it layers out, but you can take it off really easily as well, do you know when like, it's really hot then really cold, scarves like this are perfect, um, and I love the colour of it, so it'll go really nicely, with my wardrobe. So yeah, that was all the stuff I got from TK Maxx. Okay, I've put the heat on for the doggies, I'm gonna pop their food down, and then we can go in the car, and then head on the road, and then get to the event. Let's open the roof, and let some light in. What's your favorite playlist to listen to when you're in the car? I feel like everyone has, like when you're alone in the car, you put on a certain playlist. I mean, some of you might listen to the radio. I do love the radio. I feel like when me and Bradley, actually we switch it up, but, when I'm by myself, there's two playlists <laughs> that I put on. It's either Harry Styles, Harry's House, my favourite. I think that's like my number one. Or I've made a playlist of my favourite Chris Brown songs. <laughs> and I love it. Like it brings me back to when I was younger. Like you're just carefree. Like it's, it's just great. So at the moment I've got Chris Brown on. And then sometimes when I get bored of it, I put Harry Styles on. It's just great. I feel like Harry's House, I don't know what it is. That album, it like helps my anxiety. It's the weirdest thing ever, but like good weird. Um, I love it. So I'm living my best life right now, listening to Chris Brown and Harry Styles. It's great, honestly. Yeah, I am gonna be early. I'm never really that early to things, but when I met up with Rosie last week, it's so funny. I think we said like 10 or half 10, I think it was 10, and it ended up being half 10 because it took me half an hour to find a parking space. How crazy is that? So I texted her and I was like, right, I'm gonna get there earlier because one, I wanna set up my camera and stuff, and two, it scarred me last week from the parking where I couldn't find a space and the place we're going to I think there'll be I mean loads of spaces and I really don't think it'll be a problem at all but you know one of those things it's better to be early I think I say that this is the first time I'm ever early <laughs> I like to think that I'm the kind of person that's really early to things I'm not I wish I was but we're making a start today today could be the start you guys never know anyway I'll see you at the event um, and I'm really, really looking forward to it. My friend George is going as well, which is really nice. I haven't seen her in so long. Um, and then I was allowed to bring Rosie, which is really lovely. So, see you guys there. I feel like Pilates is really needed right now because me and Rosie, she's in that car there. We can't find a space. <laughs> it's like in the middle, I'm parked by the way. It's like in the middle of nowhere, which I'm not gonna lie, it's very peaceful, but we don't know where to park. What to do, to be honest. <laughs> oh. oh my god guys 
This is so eventful, it's a joke. So funny. So bad. Oh my god, so do you ever get like nervous bees? Yeah, I feel like it's a nervous wee right no, now. No, Rosie. <laughs> We've had an eventful, uh, <laughs> eventful time. An eventful time together. Oh my god, look how cute it looks. It looks really cute. I don't know what I'll be Neither. Find it. I thought that was lovely. Yeah, I did. Oh, my hair's gone a bit oh. frizzy. Oh, it says cafe. We're oh, now God. trying to find a cafe, but honestly, you guys, it look where we are. Place. I feel like we're about to get our card redone. Um, <laughs> so, we're going to another cafe. <laughs> we turned around. <laughs> that was not a bit of us. The outdoor bit looked really cute, but we're going to try and find somewhere. I've got my, my bag full of stuff. Have you got your laptop? I've got my bag full of stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is that one city bag? Yeah. Oh, I love that. I know, although I literally at the bottom, <gasps> oh. I spilled, mel I got melted chocolate all over it. So it's not <laughs> really you? giving like the gym girl yeah. vibe, I was thinking. That's chocolate. That is chocolate. Oh, it is really balance. cute though. I feel like we're at one with nature right now. <laughs> Going through here. <laughs> yeah. Let's just ignore the cars. But up here, <laughs> it's quite peaceful. Look at all the sheep. Oh, they're actually sheep up there. Yeah, it's really cute. Every time it's windy, my eyes water. Same. So it looks I'm like I'm like crying. <sighs> my mum used to have it. And then when I was younger, I was like, oh, that's so annoying. Like, why are you crying? <laughs> and then as I've got well, older, <laughs> yeah. as I've got older, I've now got it. <laughs> She's like, ha ha. I am the worst in the cold. Like, my eyes. <sighs> It's just really emotional. Don't cry, um, she's going to be crying all night. <laughs> okay, so we're going to find the other calf that looks cuter and more aesthetic, more our vibe. Mm. Look at our cars. <laughs> Lonely, because we spent about 20 minutes trying to find a space again. Oh God, that's so funny. Okay, honestly, this weather, I mean, I'm not a fan of, and my whole eye makeup has like completely gone weird. But we're gonna go to a place called Fuel Coffee House. So we shall start. So I'm now home. Honestly, me and Rosie, we had a nightmare. We planned to go for coffee after. We were meant to go for coffee yesterday and then we were like, should we just go for coffee after on the Friday because we're already with each other. So we planned to do that. And let me tell you, after the last clip, we then drove to the coffee shop that we thought was over the road turned out to be a house, so done a little U-turn, then went to like a local high street near there, tried to find a coffee shop there, walked for ages. I mean, we've got good steps in, I'm not gonna lie. Walked for ages and then we were like, um, there was nothing, nothing. I think it said a lot when the car park was empty. And then we were like, should we just call it a day and then meet next week for coffee? So we're gonna do that instead. Um, but it was so funny, honestly. I was literally like, what is going on? Um, my makeup from where, my eyes were watering outside, has completely smudged, so that's great. Um, but we honestly had the loveliest class with Georgia. I've never done Pilates before, and I'm a converter now. I really liked it. It was really relaxing, but like my whole core and my legs and stuff were really tight and good. Like you could really feel it working. We were saying at some points, like my whole body was like shaking, but. It just felt really good, so we definitely want to do it again. Um, and it was just really lovely. Like, I really, really, really enjoyed it. So now, it's currently 20 past two. So I'm gonna make myself some lunch because all I've eaten today is a protein yogurt. And my favorite snack is a protein yogurt with like a 90 cal bar and I like break it up and put it in it. 
so good. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna make myself a prawn jacket potato and then we can spend the rest of the evening together. I feel your arms around me. I need you more, need you here more than I would like to admit. Let's forget about tomorrow. Yeah, should I hide away forever? Should I close my eyes and never again hold you tight, call you mine, think about you every time? I remember that it's over. So this is my lunch that I've had literally all week. So it is salad with cucumber. I'm very simple with my salads. I don't like tomatoes, so I don't really branch out. But you could add like sweet corn and stuff. Oh my god, that would be amazing. But I've got a simple salad. Um, 20 grams of the 50% less fat cheese. A jacket potato, but I cut it up. Because I have small jacket potatoes, it just makes sense for me to cut it up. And then this is the prawns, where I use half a packet of the frozen ones. And basically, I mix it all together, so it's kind of like a jacket potato salad. By the way, the dogs are eating their food, wondering what that chomping is. And I basically mix it all together, and it's, yeah, like a jacket potato prawn salad kind of thing. Um, and that is my lunch, and it is honestly 10 out of 10. Couldn't recommend it enough. Also, oh my god, if you don't use your air fryer for your jacket potato, you are missing out. Like, the crispiness... On the skin, oh my god, is amazing. I put it in the microwave for about seven minutes, so I like turn it over halfway, and then I'll pop it in the air fryer, and I'll use the one cow spray, and then also salt and pepper, and I'll also <laughs> top it off. This is electric, by the way. I got it from Amazon. It's got a light. Me and Bradley didn't realise, although you have to put six batteries in, each of them. Six, but can you see? It's got a light. This is like changing the game for us. It's amazing. I'll pop a link to these down below because I really loved the rib look of them. Um, but yeah, this is my lunch for today and it's just under 400 calories. It's like 300 and something, which is amazing. So it fills me up and then afterwards I'm gonna make a coffee. Um, so I've got that already here. And then do loads of admin <laughs> because I was meant to do it when we're at the coffee shop. But I couldn't. <laughs> so yeah. Oh god, we're just messing each other now. Like, this is so funny because last time we met last week, we had the biggest problem ever where we couldn't find a space for ages. And then we were like, what is it with us and having a coffee? It's like the universe is like, no, you're not allowed a coffee today. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna go on Thursday, plan it properly before, which will be fun. So yeah, anyway, I'm gonna eat this now and then I'll talk to you guys a little bit. You never ever scared of the dark So why am I the one who cries? I'm so afraid to be left behind I think about you a lot It's almost like I can't stop I can't stop Yeah, yeah You never lose an argument So I've been trying to I've got my blanket I'm so sleepy today I think do you know when the weather is a little bit like grey and dull outside? It makes me feel like I just need to go to sleep. Is anyone else the same? Like I'm literally like my eyes are going, but it's fine because I've just made myself an oat ice latte. I bought um, vanilla syrup from Amazon, sugar free one, because I always have a spoonful of sugar. It's only 15 calories, but I'm kind of, do you know when you're like, I want new taste and this is amazing. My sweet snack of choice today are really cute macaroons. Now, the vanilla and strawberry are my favorite. You literally can't go wrong. I get these from Tesco's. They're frozen and you put them in the fridge for an hour to defrost them. Amazing. But the green one is pistachio and I haven't tried it before so I thought we could try it together. Cause I'm gonna lie. I wasn't expecting to like that. I do really like it. But they're just, honestly, there's something about macaroons that I'm obsessed with. One time, I think it must have been four years ago, um, I went to a benefit event, which was amazing. And it was around like November kind of time. And I remember they had these macaroons that were like giant and inside were fresh raspberries and cream 
and they were the nicest macaroons I've ever had in my life and I just wish I could have them again but these ones are amazing and the ones from m and are so good as well but these ones are a little bit more cheaper and they're so tasty and I love how they can just stay in the freezer so if I want one just got to put it in the fridge for an hour so good anyway I'm going to finish this and then I'm going to start editing this video and then Brad will be home in like two hours so yeah honestly it's such a nice Friday I really want to start doing Pilates like classes because I feel like it would be really good for me and it's so fun doing something different so if you guys are debating whether or not to like start a new class like that do it because you'll feel so good after this year I'm really stepping up my comfort zone pushing myself making myself kind of like feel uncomfortable because they say that you don't grow in your comfort zones and I think it's true I think for me personally I don't grow like as a person or my confidence if I don't step up my comfort zone um, and it's been amazing like the past three weeks I've really pushed myself and I've seen a transformation like I feel so much better within myself and um, so I really recommend you guys doing it as well anyway we're making fresh pasta again tonight because it's become our weekend thing we're obsessed with it honestly we love it so much but it's just so tasty so we're gonna have that for dinner have a cozy evening oh my god we're gonna go to the gym I forgot we didn't go this morning but yeah have a cozy evening i also want to do a pamper this evening i need to like fake tan my face um i might redo my eyelashes and just have a proper pamper as well so is i'm excited okay? it's just a face and everything is going just great i think about you a lot it's almost like i can't stop can't stop